Can't just choose what you are comfortable with. You are going to see Odorous on the Operator here. Post it up, looking for that long B aggressive peek from Envy, and he will find it right away there. Puts down Food, who does like to be that aggressive defender for this Envy team, but not this time as far as working out goes. And there's another one from Odorous. Big entries here from him over here on the B side. Oh, he's done his job and then some. Not a single point of yeah. health lost in the process. And keep in mind mm. that this is Envy's buy. Yeah. They've been waiting for this moment, and they instantly get shut down. Absolutely. They like to play an aggressive defense. I mean, particularly Food has always been really aggressive uh, defensively. But going to get silenced there. And just to give you a little bit of uh, info, in case you didn't know, Odorous was a former professional, or kind of professional CSGO player. He played for Space Station Gaming and Mountain Dew League. Played on a couple other teams at kind of that, you know, semi-pro level. So definitely, and he was an opera in Counter-Strike. So seeing him make that transition as many CS players have. Same with Maka. He was also a former CS player. Obviously, Def, formerly of Complexity in CSGO, as well on this team of Dignitas. 30 seconds left. Odorous has now been silenced by the Operator. Nice attempt from Mummy. Trying the speculative insta shots around the corner, but he can't stop spike the spike from being planted. And although he's whizzing bullets past heads, <laughs> none of them are connecting. Shock Dart is good, keeping Camera Finesse at bay. Pass. Look to push in a little bit quicker. U-Haul's control currently established. The recon, how the hell does Sam survive that onslaught? Spins around for a second. Lightning fast reactions and keeping this round in Dignitas's hands. And he could go in for another one. Uh, throughout this qualifying. It's the frenzy up close, but Sam again picking up his 10th kill. As we move into the fifth round. A real nightmare. Talisman on the side of Dignitas. Hunter's Fury. Connecting some damage onto Omen. And Caboose gets finished off as he tries to go aggressive. Bit of a desperation play. Shock dart through the dark cover lands on the head of Finesse. And Envy just can't catch a break. Nope. I mean, they're normally pretty good defensively yeah. on this map too, Vince. It's it's the map that they have one of their Last highest defense win rates besides split. Um, I think they're near 68% defensively win rate wise on this map. This is also their lowest attack win rate. And only 50%. Always waiting for it there. <laughs> and Dignitas now unrelenting on their approach. They don't want to give any mercy off to the adversaries, but maybe they should have just held their nerve a bit longer because they've run into the gauntlet of three kills. Finesse picks up two, and it's Mummy's operator that silences the other. Odorous, though, keeping this alive with his operator. He's being shoulder peaked, he's being punished, but whips out his sidearm. And Finesse gets splattered from the classic. Oh. Two right clicks to the dome. And that does keep Dignitas in this round. Yeah, there's a little bit of a window cracking open now for Dignitas to try to come back into this, but that missed shot and that kill from Food probably puts the final nails in the coffin of round number six for Dignitas. We'll see, though. Superman able to creep out. Missed opportunity there from the first player that went after him. He's able to teleport his way into heaven, but it was read by Food right away. He kind of had to do it to avoid getting deactivate that, by the way. We're still playing 1.10. No charges. And it back was used on B long. Phoenix spotted nothing. Mummy in the meanwhile was pressured. Stood his ground, delivered one shot. 30 seconds. 30 seconds left. Mike still yet to get planted. Envy rummaging together, trying to fend off. See if they can get another round on the board. Caboose, very important kill. And a second one behind it. His death is sent reeling. And Superman. That's coming with two of his own. Tack down to 20, teleporting into his own dark cover, keeps him alive a little bit longer. This round is not done just yet. But they need Odorous to have some big moments, and Superman gets a third before he's picked off. And now it's all down to the operating, wielding Odorous, who comes through with the classic and takes down Caboose, but only 14 HP. No on slower pace, I guess you could say, but Mummy gets that forward angle on short and will find Psalms. So that's a great opener here for Envy as they are trying to claw back into this map. They had that double stack on shorts. They had each other angles covered. By design, Mummy misses the second shot. Not really punished for it a great deal, though. It's step two. Has been forced away. Does get the ultimate orb, at least. Of course, used his lockdown the previous round and got caught while he planted it. Mm. And that's with a bit of an off angle, getting aggressive. 
This could backfire. If he goes down without any damage or kills, it could backfire, but he's got himself one. I believe he pulled out the neural theft to get information and was caught in the process, yeah. but Odor is still alive, still kicking. 30 seconds coming up. Recon will get a little bit of intel left. as they start making their way out of the showers through this smoke. Paranoia comes in, but it's not going to phase Mummy, who holds the angle, finds Odorous. Now it's all left to Superman. Egypt to survive a little bit longer. Going in first. Leah tossed in, not really affecting them. Mummy with the Operator rings out for the first, and now the re-aggression could be forthcoming. There's a dark cover just behind it. It's going to be hard to see how Dignitas get anything done, and they're being butchered on the approach. Finesse with two wallbang shots. Lots of damage onto Depth, who's now been finished off, and the last man standing is Odorous, who maybe can get a couple of consolation kills if they push into his cross set. But other than that, it won't be happening. A clean swagging side, but Envy's response has been not so bad itself. Nowhere to run! Odorous just... Smack through the blades. Mac is Hunter's Fury doesn't really connect. And Depth, who was put down very low, just a point away from death, and he just has to try and survive, but his teammates all around him. It's another clean sweep of around the spike carrier in Superman. Has been vanquished. And Maka, the only player that's really answered back, but he gets spotted and forced out. And I mentioned before that Depth was very close to death. He's still. Yeah standing but for how much longer i'm gonna go with maybe another second and i think even i was off there yeah i mean that was pretty much a done deal i think it really just comes down to a great combination that's a lot of intel for the teammates they can keep three on a and b but odorous comes straight in first headshot connects first blood been drawn finesto holding off against two double headshot sam and odorous put down and now food shows his hand with the phoenix rotation and it's looking great for Envy again. Dignitas still have two players, both of them are healthy, and control over the spike. And they decide to go for a rotation, but Crashies is already here. And he has all the utility at his disposal. Doesn't require it. The first wide swing goes his way as he puts a bullet into the side of Superman Ted. And although Maka does repel him, he's been dropped to 21 HP. And there's plenty of time. He doesn't have to force the spike down. He can try and catch one of these players in transition. Now they know exactly where he is. Recon Dart fired out, trying to take the initiative, trying to get up close. Takes One down the spike and wide swings in. It's the headshot onto Finesse. Surely Maka can't get this done. He's definitely going to get that spike left. planted. There's no doubt about that. As uh, it is going to be a long ways off here before his opposition is able to really make the rotate. In fact, he's not even convinced it is an A-plant just yet. Now, of course, he'll figure it all out. And Maka is still low on health, but he has the Owl Drone to kind of help him get information on this re-kick attempt. And he's got time on his side a bit. Food is the one that has to work quick here. And he's still slow walking through because he's not sure if they're holding a close corner on his way through spawn. So this is actually a tough ask of Food despite the health superiority. He's got so much he has to clear and worry about. And yeah, with the Owl Drone, it's gonna give Maka free intel a little bit later on. He does have hot hands up. though. He has blaze. He has plenty of utility that allows him a chance. He's tapped it. He knows he has to stick it if he's going to get this full defuse. Now the full stick comes in and Maka with the white swing gets a beautiful clutch. And now a fourth player to be. If Envy don't get a move on onto the site, they could be walking into a stack. They could be walking into Bedlam to mayhem. But the first two kills go their way. To boost paint shell onto Sam and a headshot ending. delivered Whoa. first class. It's immaculate for Envy. With the drone, but as you said, they're running out of time and they're also low on personnel. And Odorous is standing firm here with the Vandal to keep the main advantage flowing. Superman One now coming in as re reinforcements. And Dignitas is sweeping through this round. Envy got halted at every corner. Really great style defense here from Dignitas, really slowing down the fast-paced play that Envy liked to imp, of course. But we'll have to see. This is a bit of an eco for Envy this time around. Terminated. And the, in the pregame, we were saying that it, it should favor Envy, but you know, Dignitas are no scrubs. These guys oh, absolutely, absolutely not. can stand their ground. They can oh, deliver. Sure. It's exactly what Depth just done. Forces oh, Envy back onto short, eh? Mm -hmm. We'll be just against the lowly Omen defending. But Superman is not to be trifled with, and that's why instantly 
nullifying and repelling the push as they look to raise it to the ground and plunder Superman spray through the dark cover, taking off the head of Mummy. And Finesse tries to at least get other people really expected them to win it. They are absolutely the favorites in this one, though. Showstopper up close. Caboose has to use it. We all just fire it into vents, but no one is there. Meanwhile, Mummy pushing through. Can't quite transition into the second spray. Gets punished by Odorous. Lots of damage inflicted, though. And now the operating, wielding Odorous can perch into heaven. Some dispatching crashies. A must-win round for Envy is now open for debate. It's effectively a coin flip, but you'd maybe say it's weighted in favor of Envy being a post plant. Hot hands down into the U-Hauls. And Sam getting aggro with the Empress. Spotting food first and foremost. Two players over on this location. They desperately need an entry back onto the site. They need it now. And it comes in the hands of Caboose. They're trying to go for the defuse in amongst all the smoke and all the carnage. Oh! And they don't get it done in the last few seconds. Or in the three, take the angle. He'll now hold a different one. A drone, though, will come after him. The timing can be great, but this is a great Leer combination to step out and frag. But he still gets caught one for one. Excellent place from Tom, though, delaying so much time and not overextending until the end. A bit unfortunate, but a one-on-one. -on -one. Omen using the ult in amongst all of the chaos. Mm. Allows him to now play some mind games. 35 seconds, scattering the defenders. Yeah, it seems like they're going to set up for that same double smoke play by the truck and just try to take left. into U-Haul and then go for the plant. They've already caught one of Killjoy's utility pieces there on the ground. Smokes are going to come out. Finesse has found the turret. Cage going up as well over towards U-Haul. But Dig are finding the frags. Hunter's Fury not finding any though. Not too much information either. Killjoy putting down the lockdown. Now the Hunter's Fury on the attack side has to try and come in with some kills. A spike is being planted in the last few seconds. It will successfully go down. And just in the nick of time, Dignitas now, with just two players remaining, mm. have to try and submerge and get themselves back onto the site. Vent and Heaven will be the two angles of aggression. Maka going out first, spraying through the boxes, nothing Shock forced dark. coming. Two players in New Hall, Shock Dark goes in, Recon. They're following up, but Maka what? lies them up for a double spray, and that's it, done. What the hell? See if someone's actually going to come around the corner. And, I mean, Mummy might, might fall prey to it. The Alarm Bot will be what they need to use to figure things out. A one-for-one -one trade on the showers. Yeah, it's a one-for-one, -one, but... Jet takes so much damage. Has to play passively now with the Blade Storm, as opposed to going aggressive for those peaks, knowing that one false step... Only their life, but potentially overtime time lose. Yeah, Caboose is getting a lot of intel here on the B side. Luckily, we was an alt in play here for Def to get his omen in position. To help out here, at least get some information. But Maka, he's the big one here. Hunter's Fury takes down Caboose, gets it into a four on three retake. Opportunity to to win it here and now. Yeah, desperately, they still have Bladestorm, but they also still have Tom, who now has Empress has risen to conquer the rest of Envy. Only two players still stand. Sam doesn't even have to overcommit, just waiting for the teammates to arrive. Food tries to spray, missing out. This could be the beginning of the end of the map. And Crashy's all that remains, but not for much longer. Dignitas. Sam clutched this right off the back. It's going to be a post plant. Crashy's just holds on to it. Sam wasn't sure about that. And having the upper ground does give him the slight advantage. He can pick and choose where he moves in. He knows that he has to still be on the site somewhere. The information, certainly in his favor, is his crosshair on point. He takes a ton of damage to kick things off. But with the Ghost is all... Now they're looking to try to push into middle with the Blade Storm and see if they can somehow pull something miraculous off. But Envy so far mopping them up. Yeah, they're walking into these choke points and Envy having none of it. It, it requires a Blade Storm to even get them one kill. And the fact that Cloudburst has been put down and... Cage Two of the three players are very low here on Dignitas. It's not looking too good. Make that one. As Sam gets put down with authority on Food's Phantom. And Odorous at least gets two, but now has been quelled by Caboose's Vandal, who goes in for a third. What I was worried about is because of how weak Dignitas looked on Ascent and some of their other matches throughout this qualification. Granted, they were up against some really good teams. Um, but you just knew that Envy were going to come into this map looking a lot sharper.
given their track record on Ascent. Again, Sheriffs, but that spray was still beast mode from Crashy. Puts three down in quick succession as they look to get aggressive outside of eight. And Finesse knows where the last two are. Shock darted down to 82. Another one will be coming in with the recon bolt. Grant, have a quick look at food. Oh, well, his flank's not required. Nope, he got massacred before he could even show his back. Almond was kind of helping Sova get in position over towards Long A Halls, and they definitely want to try to attack this catwalk area. Def with the op will find one, but now gets chased down. Chased down. Caught with his pants down as well, and Caboose makes sure he will play no further part in this round. Sam in the meanwhile, though, does hold on to the window. This stops that two-dimensional push onto the side, but they have already lost it by and large. Food spike successfully planted. gets the spike planted. No mistake this time around. A real chance for Dignitas to maybe get their second round. But the wall bang goes through on the side of Food. He does fall down instantly afterwards, but he could have propelled them long enough to make this work. Now the Hunter's Fury comes into effect, having no hit markers at all, doing nothing. It does at least close off the close angle. Now Empress can be popped from Sam, but his head gets popped like his dip from Crashies, who then gets put down and it's down to Mummy. He knows where the last player is. The flick doesn't quite connect, but can teleport safe onto generators, keeping himself alive a little bit longer, trying to play with the time. It's Ring Around the Rosy, a game of cat and mouse, but it's going the way of Envious. All he needs to do is survive a little bit longer. He's got the job done and Maka can't escape with the operator. Well played and need to start finding these first picks. The thing it's is, if you're Envy and you heard that shot go off, if you know that was Killjoy, you know you're in a, a double off. Oh. That has to be a shot landed. At the very least, you've got to go one for one. Mm. And this is why I mentioned to Yinsu on the, the desk when she asked about, you know, what can Dignitas post off? I said aggression. It feels like Envy. This is just systematic autopilot. Take mid control and they're just claustrophobic and constricting Dignitas out of this game. They just yep. never seem like they can get comfortable. They never seem they can get a foothold. Yeah, I mean, Envy's that team that is very no good way. at playing standard, but they also can be, you know, again, very fast paced, and you never really know which version you're going to get round the round. And so it means that you have to really think every little decision through, and they just have not been on point. This round, they have real hopes now. They have a four on two retake opportunity. Actually, it's not even really a retake. The spike never actually made its way down. Envy just forced to. Retreat. This is Ignatas' big chance. 30 seconds left. Yeah, Tom just needs to sit here and wait. Yeah, and listen for revenge. some information. Spike down, round over. Yeah. Surely this Thunder. can't be winnable. Definitely not. If Mummy wins this, I'll retire from Valorant commentary. Right now. I don't think you have to worry about ten that. Seconds left. Listen, seconds I wouldn't put go. that on something that was risky. Oh, the Assam. Okay, never mind. Now we have completely ignored this potential. And look at that. That's a great flash there from Food. Doesn't catch Reina, who hides by the double stack and actually catches Food. And now he's off the table. And he had to run it back, Vince, which would have been massive for Envy to help use to take a sight. Now they won't have that in their possession. Yeah, hindsight 2020. And I'm sure he's going back and wishing. What if? Instead, Superman with the Bulldog ideal for this kind of a situation he's going to teleport that actually will not be him losing his life because odorous had his back covered yeah instantly repelling away the, the punishment and now Nittas trying to hold on this is the play that i said earlier was a real nightmare so many obstacles effectively walking on legos over and over again nano swarm alarm bot turret all to contend with left. and death at the back of the site doesn't have I lockdown at exactly. his disposal and doesn't have any hp either and to make matters worse for Dignitas, the Ural Theft has been tossed in for good measure. Oh Their wife. position's Your compromised. 3v2, all at the back of the site. And one of the two is Odris on 30 HP. This is where he wishes Black he had that blade storm. Remanding. He wishes he had something to pivot off. But instead, it's Superman. He has to try and move through the dark cover. Smokes Black everywhere he looks. There's Whoa! Oh, the, the headshot through the dark cover onto Crashies. Gives him a chance and keep in mind that his opposite number and the other omen, Mummy used his from the shadows to try and escape, but the ghost control wine early here. Well, you have the first. And what they're hoping is many kills on the ascent back to the top of this map at least. Depth got himself from another one. Got a bit of a slow, quiet game. And there's a third kill in quick succession. So now they can swarm the sites. 
The attackers have done everything that was asked of them and more. They now need to convert a whole bunch of rounds in a row, assuming, of course, that we don't see a 1v5 clutch from Finesse. Best of luck to you, sir, but I don't think his chances are very good. He could do a bit of damage, though, in the process. Could keep a few of these players honest, economically speaking. But now that he's took some damage and he's been forced away into the arms of Sam. Still alive, still kicking, but not for much longer. Link-focused mid-control. Superman looks to try and... Push through and persevere through the dark cover, but he and Maka both get punished. Oh wow. Emphatically with two headshots and alongside that falling down. That could be it. That could be it over, or maybe not oh, yeah. over us, who we know can use the operator. Has got his hands on it, but it's only for a brief second because Psalm is all that remains. They yeah, kind of dash into oblivion there. It's left Psalm all alone, as you noted. Spike will at least be able to come back to his possession pretty easily. But even with all the time in the world to work with, trying to find a gap is going to be tough here. All bases are pretty much covered here from Envy, and they can even allow the spike plant and just kind of work out the retake together in a three-on-one, you'd favor them. There is Empress available for Psalm, so that gives them something to, to try to use to perhaps pull one over, but still going to be a tough ask. Yeah, I wonder if he pops it if he successfully left. gets the spike planted, because then he begins to believe that this is possible. Otherwise, he may want to use it in reserve for the last round. Uh, tough to say. I mean, you don't want to just let Indy get map point. I don't even look at it. I, I would have imagined it would have seen that. That's wild. Death is really unlucky there. Maybe just a little bit off on the placement. I know that's something that Mitch has made very famous with the total turret on attacking style on this map. And that, I think that Death was trying to do the same thing, but just got caught. Psalm so popping the Empress and they're looking to hammer away here. Uh, I'm all playing. I'm kind of a bit of a fake right now, but it's not working out. No, oh, they've been straight up smacked down by the A defense. And it's back, it's been popped in. And it's all on the Empress now. And mm, be playing slowly up middle, not giving any information away. Oh. And it needs to one tap onto Death, who never saw it coming. Wow. He's taking a dirt nap. And Envy switch across to a Spectre. With middle control and very little damage done against them, they're in a good position. Yeah, that's got the Looney Tune canaries flying around his head right now. He got absolutely beamed. That's given Envy a lot of control over towards Mail and yeah. Ropes, who's forcing scrambling out of Dignitas' rotations. And even with low firepower, Envy can pose a threat My here based on positioning alone. Cool threat. Oh, so that is dirty at two. And a third, and the spike down, and indeed the round will follow. You can see him. <laughs> they need to push this Reyna offense. Well. They need to get him out of there, and that's big, because now they can go for the Breach Flash and the Blast Pack combo on Ray's with the Jet Dash. Or they could just fall off and just play against the rotations. And it looks like that's what they're going to do. They're going to go to Ramen and watch for the mid-push. Oh, Paint the pulled out. The timing could not have been worse. And Orpheus gets punished, but Superman now stepping up with two of his own before he gets silenced. And a 2v2 falls upon us, but Mummy with 3 HP does have the Operator, so at least has the ability to instantly silence somebody, but this is looking grim again for Envy. I'm surprised they didn't just follow up that pick on Reyna. They're usually a team that would explode off of something like that, especially when you already have the Jet and, and Reyna in position to jump in, and you had the Breach there for flashes. It just seemed like they would just roll it open. That's the envy I'm used to seeing, but they decided to be a bit more reserved, left. fall back to ramen, watch for a mid-push, just try to play their numbers advantage, which is fair enough. It's not a necessarily a wrong approach, but they got caught up a little bit there, and now it's an even two-on-two. Two. They're trying to get into defensive spawn. Def is watching if they come B-side. Indeed they are. They're going to fall right into his hands, but the timing might get them. Timing has got him, and they have enough time to get the spike down as well. That's so brutal. He was looking at the perfect spot. And he thought better of it. He will be so upset about this outcome, unless Maka can get the 1v2. Flashpoints tossed out, making moves in. Perfect angle, takes down the spike out. But the first kill... When it's all said and done, they will just kind of walk in here and spot Maka. He's now going to be paranoid. He's trying to stay alive as long as he can, but he gets found exactly. out by Finesse, and their old Theft is going to be deployed as well, and I don't see how Dinosaurs get back into this. They're going to have to work fast. Spikes planted. No 
caught up close really quickly. The food with two it was a bait and switch. Yep. That was real flashy. I love that. Me too, man. I looked really sick when the tail was shot. I mean, I think that dude. mummy wanted to hit the operator shot up for the site. I guess Ass will know this is his think possibility. There's not much time left, but Caboose is now putting bullets to faces, and Sam also chips in with one. They have no idea that Maka could be up close. You could see Food had his knife out of all weapons. And now he starts to go for that plant. Ten seconds with left. Ten seconds to spare. He will get it done. How's your aim? Be very little room for error for Caboose. He gets the first, it's his third kill in the round, but Superman will not miss. Pulls the trigger. Gets a fourth round for Dignitas. They're first in four. Yeah, gonna be tough in a 1v2 and you have to pop that Leer to just give yourself vision. And with Rays and Jet. Utility is plentiful. Good alt line, but again, not fully capitalizing on this, although Death has gone in for two. Pardon me. Mommy does come back with one of his own. Death did a great job. The first time we've really seen him play too aggressively outside of there, but Crashy's making the most. Odris just runs into his demise. Yeah. It feels like maybe they got a bit too carried away with their success. We'll see. They still have a lot to use, right? They still have one flashpoint left on Maka. They still have his alt if they need it. They have their omen has already flanked through B and is Off inside. It's Superman by Ramen. There is going to be Off the <laughs> juxtaposing alts there from Breach. Rolling Thunder cancels the Rolling Thunder. Things you love to see. And now, Ooh. the Aftershock takes down food. That's something you see too often. I thought he would be able to get away from that, considering the positioning, but does not. Mummy will get eradicated there. Great defense. Tower and maybe making the most of it, but Sam is up close. They also have depth with the operator just behind him. It's a bait and switch, and it works to perfection. It's a hit and run, and Sam lives to tell the tale. He's out of there. 20 seconds to play with. Showstop has been picked up. A kill will be forthcoming to Odorus. Dignitas, a flawless hold. Losing minimal damage in the pro here, and we'll see how it works. Fire in the hole! Has uh -oh. been picked up. Doesn't get any kills, though. Odorus goes in with the first. It's a great flash point. And Mummy makes the most of that. Headshot onto Sam. They came into this round with two sheriffs. Economy was in real trouble, but they're making what little they had work. Death again is having a lot of impact with this operator. But he finally falls prey to Mummy. And that will be all down to Maka, but not for much longer. Aggressive getting behind the attackers. And this could be a bloodbath. There's one and a second and a third. Sam sprays them down. They get aggressive elsewhere with Superman and Odorus. Aggressive here. NB Lobby is going to be Envy, but Mummy gets caught. But will they know about Caboose, who also resides in this position, playing at the corner? He's going to get some assistance from Finesse because he can't really get away without crossing into the crosshairs of death. Finesse will... And I wonder if that means that they won't expect another to be here. But no, never mind. Death too wise to fall for that. I like the idea from Finesse there to try to... Make them think that he was the last one there, but didn't work out. Def has played that so well. Placing swarm grenade. There is a vast discrepancy in weapons, though. Effectively, this is a bonus round on Envy. They had a bunch of Spectres coming into this. So, not necessarily expecting to stomp this round, I think it's safe to say. Flashpoints are good and allowed Finesse to take the initiative. He's dropped down two players, but also the Spike. And also has a Sheriff, so has that one tap ability. 30 HP separating him and his demise, but now he's been pushed off his mortal coil by Death, who's got three. He gets traded back out again. And now all the falls upon Crashies, who has funneled away the attackers. The spike is now transitioning and traversing back over onto the A side of the map, but he probably gets caught out by Odorus. It's a freebie, and Dignitas, six seconds left to scurry away and vacate the premises. They decide to push in instead, and now the detainment begins. Doesn't catch anybody, oh. and Mummy through the smoke, taking down one, hopping into the air and trying to use his blade storm. Connects on to absolutely nobody. Dignitas with a successful post plant comes in and food gets caught by the fault line. Can still keep pushing forward though. Does he anticipate the close angle? He does. Spins around for a second. Could be a bubble. Oh, gets more. Through the wall, he takes down Maka. Food with an astounding retake. 
what a roller coaster ride of a round. I mean, initially it was looking great for Indy, even though the lockdown forced them to play retake. They had a great combo of big assistance from Death and Superman. They are both playing really, really well. <laughs> Speak. There it is. Uh, the caster's curse, of course. The good old curse, the classic. Love to see it. Hate to see it at the same time. <laughs> You are right, though. I mean, Sam's been having a, a great best of three series, but oh yeah, it's been a bit, little bit quiet in the first two maps. It's good to see him really emerging mm -hmm. in this one, but they're going to need him more than ever here. That player down finish line within touching reach of both teams. Oh yeah, they need a hero play. It is indeed neck and neck on the final stretch here. So you are going to see them again. Just you know, Dignitas able to get mid control, able to control both fence and male. So again, options open. Can cause a lot of misdirection, can make a lot of quick transitions from side to side, but Mummy has a good angle here, watching ropes, great shot on the Odorous, able to get away as well. Oh, They're gonna keep team. following up though. That's so sick. That's so sick from Mummy. Such a beautiful... And although he saw multiple players pushing in towards the B tower, he can't be sure they fully invested behind this. They're fully committed to this push. Now he realizes it. First kill goes his way, and a second. There's the three. Oh my! And a fourth. Every bullet used perfectly. Impeccable aim. A 4K. And although it's against sheriffs, you cannot fault that aim. Yeah, exactly. That's still a good illustration, especially for that last kill. Just that little micro adjustment of the crosshair to get that fourth frag. So far, all their success has been on islands in a sea of envy, dominance. Somebody out. Fault line is so brutal to contend with, and there's a, a dark cover right behind it. Crashies is using his own up close, gets two, and a flashpoint behind it finally gets charged down. Sam gets the retreat. I don't think that will be good enough. Envy no. still have a player up. Indeed, they do, and now Mummy's in position with the operator to add on to it. Food pitching in as well. Now, all on Superman.